Good day everyone and welcome to Excel News, the weekly show that brings you all the important news and information on Path of Excel. And the first news this week was the Immortal Syndicate Free For All, which we already covered last week anyway. So we're jumping right into the supporter packs, concept art for synthesis, and there's quite some concept arts there, and it's pretty amazing. You can see things like this, which might have not made it into these packs, but who knows, they may be used for a later one. And well, GGG already said they create content they don't need yet, so that when they happen to need it, they might have it ready already. So who knows, they might they might have created this thing and maybe it will become an exile one day, maybe it will become a boss. I will see, maybe it will become nothing. Also we got the 3.7.0 announcement timeline, which is not announcement yet. The real announcement is happening on the 22nd of May, which means a couple days from today, and uh, it's gonna be the full details of the 3.7 expansion that's expected to launch in early June. So that's really cool. We also got a teaser image over here. Who knows what it is? It really looks like some uh, NPCs or whatever running away from something on the horizon. Uh, people have been speculating a lot on the names of the league. Uh, it happens to be on a list which was um, which kind of became a meme and it was posted on reddit on the 2015 I think and it was uh, the names of the most popular metal band at the time so well it's probably one of those names Bex is playing with people on uh, Twitter so if you want to go into the game just get on Bex Twitter anyway other than that well this image is pretty clear we just need to see what they are running away from and we also got some sentencing stuff and these are statistics for uh, both the synthesis and the solo self found synthesis and the temporary leagues, uh, which are the flashback going. But the, the the statistics were made at the beginning of the league, so we'll see. First up, and uh, the most important thing is that the trickster is dominant in pretty much every single chart you make, however you make it. Most interesting in the solo self found, uh, it's like one third of the population and together with the occultist they make up for more than 50% of the all solo self found populations which is kind of impressive. The other strong classes as always have been occultist, juggernaut and elementalist with a bit of inquisitor and you can mix and match those but it's kind of the same for everything except, except actually for the PS4 where the elementalist Necromancer, I mean, it's not that different yet, but you can see from the percentages over here that it's much more balanced. And that's probably because PlayStation 4 players are mostly new players and they don't really realize most of the people that PC players realize because PC players have a lot of past uh, playtime on the leagues and they kind of feel into the meta and all the kind of stuff. So there's also the flashback league for the PS4 and the Xbox stuff which is a bit more similar to the PC but with percentages very close to the PS4 so it feels like uh, consoles are gradually gradually um, following the PC version and falling into the meta as well although it is a bit too soon to judge but uh, I'm sure GGG is keeping those uh, pretty much checked and it, it doesn't really need to be said, but uh, the Berserker class is pretty much the lowest on most of these, except on the PS4 one, which is, to be honest, expected because uh, Berserker looks really cool, feels really cool, probably, even though uh, on paper is one of the worst class in the game due to the damage it receives. So newer players will tend to go to the road, uh, more seasoned players will definitely not. But yeah. This was a short week, next week is gonna be a big announcement, so that was all for this week, so if you enjoyed the video leave a like and a comment down below, also if you want to be updated every week be sure to subscribe to my channel. So that was all, I've been your host Orzo, and I'll see you guys the next time.